do work on behalf of Mr. Depp? We were engaged in engaged. March of 2016, if that's your question. Right, right. Around February 10th, is that when you were first contacted? I do not recall the date. And you said you were introduced by executives, a uh, guy named Richard Smith at the Bank of California? Yes. Mr. Depp owed a um, significant amount of money to the Bank of California at that time, correct? No. He owed money to the Bank of California, correct? I do not recall that he had an active indebtedness with the Bank of California. He had other uh, commercial loans, but not with the Bank of California. And after you were brought on, you developed an understanding that Mr. Depp's financial status was very challenging, correct? It was challenging, but we had an ability to resolve the problems if they were properly addressed. He had liquidity problems, right? He had substantial assets in excess of his liabilities, but he had short-term obligations that needed to be satisfied. Let me just ask that again. At the time that you were brought on, he had liquidity problems, correct? Can you define liquidity for me? I'm, I'm, I'm asking you. At the time he was brought on, he had liquidity problems, correct? I would define the term liquidity as where the short-term assets are less than the short-term, excuse me, are less than the short-term liabilities. And if that's how you're defining liquidity, I would agree. In layman's terms, terms that, that I can understand, because I don't, I don't speak all the, the kind of business school terms that you speak, he didn't have enough money at the time, correct? He was spending more than he was bringing in, correct? Yes. And you gave him advice about how he could hopefully get out of that problem, correct? Yes. Okay. And just to be clear, uh, Mr. White, because you, you've testified to, to some degree of knowledge about um, wine that you, you, you allege that Ms. Hurd requested. So you seem to have some, some knowledge of, of Mr. Depp's spending. Ms. Hurd didn't, she didn't buy any of the dozens of properties that Mr. Depp owned, correct? Correct. He owned she, the assets prior to their marriage. She didn't pay $5 million to blast Hunter Thompson's ashes out of a cannon, did she? Not to my knowledge. She didn't buy a yacht that she couldn't afford and then have to sell it to J.K. Rowling, did she? Not to my knowledge. Now let's talk about that meeting on April 21st, 2016. You said the meeting started at about 7.30 p.m.? Yes. And lasted till maybe 9.30, is that right? Yes. And you have no idea, no personal knowledge where Mr. Depp went after he left that meeting, do you? That is correct. I did not go with him. I went home. And at that meeting, Mr. Depp was given some catastrophic news about his business, correct? He was given news that he needed to address a number of financial issues, but I had a strategy and plan to fully resolve them. That news that he was given that night was catastrophic, wasn't it? No. May I approach, Your Honor? No. Yes, sir. Mr. White, let's do this again with another under oath series of statements. You gave testimony in the UK trial, did you not? Yes. And that testimony was under oath, correct? Yes. All right. And in front of you, I have your testimony from the UK trial, and you gave that testimony on behalf of Mr. Depp, correct? I gave it honestly. Okay. You gave it on behalf of Mr. Depp, correct? You were one of his witnesses called. That correct? is correct. Okay. Can you please turn to page 865? And it's just the second page of the document, upper left. Before that, the questions are talking about this meeting on April 21st, 2016. And you were asked the question, question, now, Mr. Depp was given some catastrophic news about his business. Answer, that is correct. Did I read that right? 
You did, but remember, that, that, that was when I question. get a chance you, you to respond, my question, sir. You I my did question. not define sir, that term. Sir, Mr. you'll have a chance. To, you, the attorney will get back up and, and redirect you, okay? So if you could just answer his question, that's fine. And the reason I'm asking, sir, is because you just gave the exact opposite testimony here. So that's, what, that's why we pointed that out. Um, now, you at this meeting, you had a discussion about his financial affairs and a necessity to formulate a revised business strategy and plan, correct? Yes. And you talked about the following financial information. You talked about bank obligations and tax liabilities, right? Yes. Which means money you owe to either the government or banks, correct? Yes. You talked about assets that he needed to sell, correct? Yes. Properties and things like that that he needed to sell to generate money? Correct. You talked about ways to reduce spending, correct? Yes. And you talked about how to get new engagements, correct? Yes. How to get new gigs, right? Not how to get them, but the I encourage you to, to get them. I, I'm understood. not an agent. I, I appreciate do not that. procure his engagements. And the, understood. You, you talked about the need to get new gigs to generate additional money to help uh, address these financial woes that he was experiencing, correct? Yes. Okay. You also told him at that meeting that um, his taxes, he hadn't paid taxes in years, correct? Uh, no, that's not correct. That he had not paid any taxes in years is not correct. That, that he was significantly delinquent in federal tax obligations dating back years, correct? I don't know how you're defining years. There were delinquent liabilities. I addressed them uh, and formulated a plan. And you talked about the significant delinquent tax liabilities that would run into the millions of dollars for taxes unpaid, correct? That is correct. And so after receiving these, this catastrophic news, as we discussed, you have no idea where Mr. Depp went when he walked out of the doors of his office, correct? I do not know okay. where he went. Can you pull up Plaintiff's Exhibit 936, please? And Mr. White, I'm, I'm not going to... Um, this is a long, a long document um, that we can we can scroll through. But what I'll I'll represent to you and, and Michelle can sort of scroll down is that these these appear to be Mr. Depp's tax returns for Mr. Depp and his companies from 2009 to 2019. Do you see that? Yes. And um, these are are returns as part of your um, role as his CPA firm now, his business manager firm now, you, your firm prepares these tax returns, correct? Yes. And you maintain these tax returns in the ordinary course of your business, correct? That is correct. Your Honor, I'd, I know there's going to be plenty of redaction to do, but I just would like to move these into evidence. I don't plan to publish them or anything at this point. Objection, Your Honor. You want to approach? 